Welcome. It's strategies that win the game online. It's strategies and tools that wins money making online. Today I'm going to show to you how you can make thousands of dollars from low content books on Amazon. Now, I'm sure if you're following me on this channel, you would have seen me do a lot of low content uh, tutorials, which by the way, if you come to African Giant, make money dot online.com and you put Amazon on the search bar here and then search you can see all the tutorials I've made today I want to show you an high level of how this is done on the estimate you can make over a thousand dollars every month by practically downloading for free these low content books I have some metrics I'm going to follow through and I want you to stay with me as I do this one of the easiest ways to make money online it is Amazon KDP using the low content books. But then if you are asking, what are low content books? I don't know what that is. Very smooth for beginners. Let me tell you what low content books are. They are books that contain some written content, but are far less, more words than usual. We all know what a textbook is. Let me show you an example. If you have a notebook, and I'm going to show you by telling you the types as well, because on my own uh, dashboard here, that's one of the things that I'd written down. Okay, just follow me as we do this, the types of low content books. I have a lot of them, and I'm just going to use these to explain things to you how it works. For example, recipe book. Low content is something that has lots of lines and less words. That's recipe book, like your notebook. That's a low content book. The number of words in it are so few. Just like journals. Let me show you another one. That's another type. Log books. Where maybe if you have a school, people are signing in and signing out and they are doing that on a sheet of paper. Then that's little words. It has a lot of line in it. Do you know how many thousands of dollars you can make via this? If you have not looked into this before and you want to make money online, I beg of you to look into this. Because there are lots of it. Journals. Just like I said. Your diaries that you write things in. Those are low content books and they sell a lot. Look at this. BSR is 12, 1005, 6006, 7006. You can't do away from these things. Let me show you another one. Coloring books. Coloring books. Look at their BSR, 3500. If you have come to Kindle before, you've not, even if you're a fresh beginner, don't worry. I'll take you by the hand and show you everything step by step. I came loaded. And I want you to stay with me while we'll do this. Can you see this? It's a lot of money on the table that you can make. Activity books. By the way, I'm not just going to, uh, you know, stay only on that. I have lots of them and I'm sure you can have access to this. Let me read them for you strictly. Guest books. Kids learning book. You see? Pen and paper game book. Activity books. Coloring books. Log books. Journal books. You see? Planners, prompt notebooks. And that's not all. I have 32 of these because that's how I work. I have my list so I know what I'm working on. And then you can now, you know, just go through things that way. Okay? Let me just continue. I have a gift for you in this uh, tutorial. And I'll give it to you point blank. And that's I'm going to make low content books for three people. I'm going to make two, two for you across the profitable niche. I will do the keyword research. That's my gift for you in this tutorial. Because now, if you want to know how to do keyword research of content books, it's very easy to do. I'm still going to show you a tool in this tutorial that will let you download the internal or everything inside for free. Very smooth, right? Yes, very smooth. But then, how do you do keyword research? Go to this uh, channel, African Giant. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe, by the way, so that you won't miss anything. And then, if you look for Amazon on my search bar here, or you go to the real site bar up and put Amazon KDP. That's what you do. Please follow me so that you will get everything. And then you say African Giant. If you search this way, you will still see what I'm about to show to you. So either you search from this search bar here or you search from the main bar. Now, how to do keyword research. This is it. Look at this. How I sell over 600 low content books monthly on Amazon. The low content book keyword research. There are two types of keyword research. I don't make the mistakes. This one is the one I'm about to let you see, the low content one. But then you can also see another one that I made, which is keyword research on Amazon if you're writing books. 
This is it, the keyword strategy here. This one too is perfect. Very fantastic, it's in-depth. This as well is in-depth. Please and please make sure you see this. I don't want to go over it again by, you know, telling you how to do keyword research because I've already done it here. So just follow through that and get it. I'll leave it in the description below so you won't miss anything. Now, how do you design your low content book? Now, this is very important because now if you search for the keywords that you need and now you need low content and if you are a fresher, fresher, let me show you what keyword research means. For example, now, uh, this is recipe book. On this recipe book, look at something here. Those are the metrics you look at for 4,000 research. That's recipe book. All. You are going to use all. Because if I click on this, you can see on different categories, use all so that you can see everything about it. Your target is to get this one, a keyword that is less than 1,000 or on 1,000. So, recipe book is too much. That means you now need to twitch the keyword so that you can rank on that keyword. Now let's see example. There are tools that can help you on that. For example, here I have the Amazon Expander, AMZ Suggestion Expander that can give me more keywords just as a glance. You see, Amazon will give you these keywords, but AZ Expander gives you all of these. The, these uh, pink, green, and all of these are from that keyword. So you can really see uh, extra things you can put to rank on. Let me click on Cocktail Recipe Book. I'm just clicking just uh, at random. This is 3,000. At least it's better off than what we had before. So you can check out again and see which other one. That's all you go through minimally to see the one that you can rank on, basically, uh, that you can make sales on. Because if you write, if you put up a low content book on this keyword, which is just this uh, recipe book, you it will be very difficult for you to rank. Let me see recipe book for kids or something uh, for kitchen. Let's see this. I'm sure that might be low. Yeah, this is 844. You see that? And then you can now create something on this. But that's not the only metrics. You still have to look at the BSR. BSR is how many of these books are people who are already selling? How many of these books are they selling? And do you have these books on the front page? For example, this keyword now, you can see these are no low contents, they are materials. You don't want to make a book where people that are searching are looking for materials to buy. So you also have to look at that. Just look at that book, uh, that tutorial I told you about here, this one, and then you, it's one week ago now, and then you see a lot of things in there. That's just to do that. Now to design, I have two things I'm going to tell you. One is absolutely free. The other you have to put in a work because the free version where you can download all this interior for free without doing anything is just a click. I'll show it to you. But you also need to know how to build it because there are some low competition keywords that you would find and you won't see low content interiors in them for free. So you need to know how to do it. On this channel as well, I've done that. I treated that. Let me show it to you on my page so you will know how this is done. Okay, it's virtually the same principle. Look at this one. You can make $1,000 making coloring books on Amazon KDP. How to make this coloring book? That's the example I made there two weeks ago. And then you as well can jump on these and learn how it's done. But let me just show you in one second how this is done. If you go to canva.com, which is Canva, whether you have the pro version or the, uh, you know, free version, it doesn't matter. You can do, you can use the free version. All you have to do is very simple. Get your measurements right, which is just one single measurement you can write that down anytime you want to create uh any of these books go to create designs when you click on that you need a custom made design and you can see it here custom size now when you click on custom size it brings out the size you want this is in pixel you have to put it in inches so you click on it and then you can see in which means inches then the regular size which is the custom size you use forever anytime you want to create a low content is here just put 8.625 just write this down it's in inches and the height is always 11.25 i taught on this channel um how you can use a plugin or a tool to do this but then uh, that's if you want to be like a pro pro you get to that later but for now let's just stick to this just copy this down 8.625 inches by 11.25 inches that's the custom size for most of your low content and that's all you should use you click on create and then you get to the page i'm just showing this to you in two minutes like i told you so
so that you will know how this is done. And then now you now have to start creating based on whatever you want to do. If you are doing lines, if you are doing journals, if you are doing whatever it is, and you can spy through what people are doing. Okay? You can really spy through what people are doing. Let me click on this and see what's inside here now so that you can see what I'm talking about. The art of... No, no, no. That's not... Is it journal? Cocktail cool book. Okay? Let me wait and see. Let it load. And then we confirm if it's a journal for us to see inside or not. Because at the end of the day, whatever you are creating, you need to see those people who had created something in that range before. And then you can now do the same. For example, let me click on this. Uh, this doesn't look like the stuffs that this is made of because all you need is either a journal or a recipe let me go to that because that's the least things that's the most important thing you can do okay this is a password book which is another keyword you can look into you know i treated that in the keyword research so just get into that all you need here is just to ensure that you see what's inside so that you know what you can make for example this password keyword is uh let me see this i'm trying to see the inside of it it's not showing the inside. I think most people now know that people are getting what's on their inside. But that's not a problem. There's also a way to do it. You say password. That's what it does. I'm just doing this off my head now. Because if you don't have that, go to Google and put password low competition. Oh, sorry. Low content. <laughs> low content interior. Google has the answers to virtually everything. Then you go to images. So you can see what's inside. Boom. You see what I'm saying? So you have the idea of what they have on their inside. That's just simple. And then you can click on anyone. This is primary logbook pages, password logbook. Because there are so many people that have lots of passwords across businesses. So you can see what's inside. Then you know how to design yours. You see how that works? Aha. Now I know what's inside. How they put it websites. Facebook password, password like that. Then I'm going to make mine. So I go back to my page. Now you start with... Go to elements. I'm not going to teach you everything here. I've done that in this tutorial. I'm just showing it to you so that you see how easy it is. Then you put lines on elements. You click on it. It will bring out the lines that are possible. So whatever line you want to use, for example, this one, this is a line. And then you can duplicate that and you copy and paste it. And then it can, you know, you can just arrange it. Then you copy again and paste like that. And then you can arrange these and you see, I'm beginning to build my lines, and that's how you do it. And that's why I did this, which is a coloring book, because I just go to different elements, I put it up, and then you can create a coloring book. All you have to do now is, if it's coloring book, you have to give different patterns. So, and minimally, I use uh, some are 50 pages books. If you are using low content, some are 120 pages. This, for example, you can add more page. You see, add, this is now page two. You see it here, page two. And then, if you want to add titles to it, you can title your page individually. Maybe what you're doing here, coloring book, is about birds, or be a good pet lover, or something. This is the title of this one. You can go to the second and say, maybe nature. So, most of the things you're going to build there will not be uh, from nature. Okay? So, you are searching your templates. You are looking for whatever is in nature. Maybe clouds. You do clouds. For example... And then it's going to bring you all the types of cloudiness that appear, you see, all of that. And then you can use any. I click on this. It's a pro version. There are free versions. And then you can use it, you see. Then you start building again till you build. That's how it's done, right? Okay, now, after that, what next is how to get low content books for free, which is the major reason why I want you to see this. Because I'm sure not everybody's that technical to get this. But all of us can do this copy click thing. Now, to get low content, you have to go to the description of this video now and you'll see a link there. The link carries this link. There are two things there you would click. This is the very first link. It's http bookbolt.io giant low content. Now, when you use this link, the reason I'm bringing this to you is you have the free version and the paid version. I'll show you the two. Okay? You have to use active coupon 20 if you are buying so that you can get 20% off your purchase. It's very cheap. You go is per month, but I'll show you everything. Now let's go to bookboat.com and I'll show you how this is done. This is bookboat.io. I'm sorry, 
bookboat.io. You can start for free. You don't need to, uh, you know, pay money for the free versions. I'll show you the amount, the gigantic volume that the free version has as well. Okay, so you get everything. Look at the price. I'm just, I just want to show you the price. Uh, for monthly price, no, if it's monthly, it's less than ten dollars, or let's just say ten dollars for newbie. Okay, you have three day free trials. Key keyword product research. I'm telling you this because I'm always straightforward with everyone. But there are free versions. I'll show you the free versions. But look at this. You can do Amazon chart volume, cover and interior design. You can do product research. It, it's an incredible, incredible tool. And I'm telling you the truth. This is one of the best tools I've used online to make money. It's very easy to do. And you can make a lot of money but then let's just go with the free version now this is charging 10 percent uh ten dollars if you use the code active coupon 20 this code you are going to get 20 percent off that purchase meaning there will be 20 percent off ten dollars you pay that's like what that's like eight dollars or there about 20 percent of that i'm not certain and then you can click on the link directly to take you to this page that i am in now let's go into it. If you sign in, just like I've signed into Active Coupon now, if you sign in, this is what you're going to see. They have uh, all the you know tutorials, short short tutorials. If you don't know how to use it, maybe you're a beginner. I'm going to make a full tutorial about this uh, particular tool, Bookboat, but I want you to just jump on it now by going to the description, clicking on the links, or using the Active Coupon 20 code so that you can get going immediately. Now let me show you how these things work. You can search on products. Right, you see product here. Now I'm searching pets, pets on coloring books. As soon as I hit on search, it will calculate everything you have to do for you. So you don't have to, you know, calculate what's the BSR, what am, are they selling, are they not, how much is the price, or the average price. No, look at it. Keyword is pet, total result that is searching now 100 is giving you the average uh, BSR, which is less than 300,000. That's my own metrics. So this is good. The low price, lowest price is $3.58. Highest price is $9.99. Average price is $7.73. For those of us that have problems with how much should we charge, now you see you only have to charge average price of everything you're using. Fair enough. By the way, you can use this for free. All these tools I'm showing to you, you can get them for free, even from the free version. Doesn't necessarily mean you have to pay before you see some of these things. Okay? Then, this is the category I chose, which you can choose different categories. You see, from notebook, journals, puzzle, comic, whatever. A lot of it you can get from the product. Now, these are all the books. Right from this place, you can see what BSR. You can see what the ratings are, how many reviews they have, how much they're selling, just at a glance. So you would know what the covers look like, what your cover should look like. If what you're targeting in keywords is good, everything is here. You see? But the juicy part we've not gotten into. Now, if you go to the clouds, I'm just showing you bit by bit. I'll do the full tutorial on this. If you go to clouds, it's going to give you the best top 100 bestsellers in which category you want it. All you have to do is put your keywords. Now, I put coloring book keywords because I want to know whatever category. Uh, this one, I can even choose coloring book and then I search. So I can see the top rated bestsellers, see what their range is. Uh, range is and then we, I can figure out what I'm trying to do. This is going to help you a lot. Look at this. Now you see everything right on the spot. The coloring books are selling well. How much they're selling, what their prices are, what their BSR is. This is what they're selling on the average per month. Basically, that's the way I calculate. There's a BSR tool. Uh, we call that TSP. Let me get that for you. TCP. Uh, TCP. Kindle. Let me just put Kindle. Kindle Publishing something something. Let me search it on Google. Um, let's get that out. Uh, TCP calculator. I know that TCP calculator. Kindle. Okay, because most times you really want to know how much they are selling. Uh, my TCP calculator. Of, let me put BSR again. This is becoming okay this is it tck sorry publishing you know i don't use it regularly because when i see lower bsr i just run with that i don't really stress myself like look at this you can calculate this now maybe it's 352 if that's what the bsr rank is and then you want to know what they are selling you change to book you want to know the sales per month and sales per day just eat on calculate 
Whoa, you can see what I'm talking about. That's why I don't need to look at it because I know it's high already. That book sells 298 per day and 4,400 every single month. You see what I'm talking about? And that's the one that has a BSR of 353. This book you are looking here, this book alone sells over 4,400 every single month. And it was published June 21, 2019 and has been selling that way. And the price is what? $4.99. So just calculate it. Just one single book is making over $10,000. You see, so from here you can now know what the case is and you know what to build very well. There is also what we call the book categories because if you don't know how to put your categories, when it's time for you to log into your Kindle publishing, let me show you that in a bit uh, so that you see what we're talking about. I go to Bookshelf now. Um, okay, now from here, you see, if you are going to post anything and you it on let me say i want to post on paperback i'm just showing you the details i don't want you to miss anything i've treated all in the tutorial i'll leave the playlist at the end of this video so you can click on it and see all the things i've treated now you can see you put your book title everything but look at here you would see as you go down you see choose categories now this category is the most important thing in a book apart from the title and the subtitle because absolutely people need to see your books so if you arrange if you pick on the right choice of category you can see and it's a lot if you're non-fiction look at all these categories sometimes you don't even know which one to choose because when you choose this it still has another lot and that's not even all it goes like deeper 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 you see and then you know a lot of things here but then book both will solve that for you because as soon as i put my keyword which i want to rank on look at what it does it just brought out all my possible uh categories so i look through it and it tells me their relevance it tells me the relevance, if the relevance is high, if it is medium, if it is low. So you have to stick with a high relevance so that you can get your books into the right place. But then if there are no real categorization, it will tell you. Like this one is design and book. This is what I always use basically here. And then you just look through it. Form and pictorial too is good. Picture books are good as well. And then you will now add the extra seven, which is in another tutorial. Please subscribe to this channel so you will not miss anything. Now, the next thing for us to do now is to now download the free books okay and i'm not done yet i'll still teach you how to design the book covers because absolutely you need that and i'll teach you how to upload low content books on amazon as well but now let's get the free version i'll leave in the description below this particular link so that you can download for free you see you don't even need to sign in basically provided you have clicked the first link i told you that will bring you to book both now there are some free and paid look this blank page is free which is a notebook all these line pages are free you can see monthly to do list is free bill tracker is free all of these are free do you see mood tracker is free all these interiors are free interiors are free the ones that are paid okay there will be paid version i use the premium version okay i use the premium so you see all of them are free but if you are on paid version if you're on free version the one that you can use it will write it members only so you will know it won't allow you to click it Aha. But do you know all of this I can download as many as possible in thousands and tons? You see the way I'm scrolling? They have... Look at Food Journal here. So this is Food Journal. All I need to do to download Food Journal is no bleed. That's what you should use. It already gave you the mark, which is 5 by 8 inches, which is good. What count? I need 120 pages. You see how easy is that? I click on download. One minute, boom. You see that? That's how I have my interior. <laughs> That's why you see a lot of people will say I have 10,000 uh, Amazon books which are low content. This is what they do. They just click it and that's it. Look at my download here. It's easy, it's smooth, it's direct, and that's it. How bad is this? And this can make you money when you do your keyword research and you can do your cover. That's all you have to do. It's asking me to save it. This is food journal. I title it properly so I don't need to, you know lose anything it's already in pdf so you don't have to do food journal and and i click on save it will download everything for me to use this is already made and i can upload it now immediately i can upload look at it page one page two page three it's already all the pages two page i'm scrolling down boom to page 120 so if you have one one thousand pages you have it and then the next thing to for you to do now is to go create your cover how difficult is this you see what i'm saying and then the good thing about both book both is you have this in varieties of types look 
daily fitness, workout log, 33 day challenge, garden planting tasks, prayers, school timetable, like everything, all interiors, classroom expenses, whatever. This can even give you ideas of keywords you choose target, family refrigerator inventory. And I'm going to type that. <laughs> I'm curious about that because I can't even exhaust it. It's a lot of interiors here. Family refrigerator inventory. I want to see what that is going to be. That's the first time I've seen that. Family refrigerator inventory. Look at it here. I want to see how many it has. And then we'll see 173. It's low. Let me see if people are selling on this. Okay. It's not like it's selling, selling like that. We have household inventory. Maybe that's a better keyword to target. You know, it's not about very low competition. Are they selling as well? What is their BSR? And that all of these book boats can do for you. Because all you have to do is go to your products. Let me do that now again. Just go to your products and then eat on. Let me use this so that you can just see what people are doing there and what they are not doing. I just put this now and let's do journals. I do journals, I click on search, and it will tell me what they are doing, but absolutely, I'm 100% sure it's not going to be that good. You see, there's nothing on journals, so I'm not going to focus on that at all, because absolutely, there's no best seller anywhere around it. It's always obvious. So, now let's make the back cover very interesting. To make back covers are very simple, because whatever you can see, you can gather ideas from. And that makes it easy. For example, if I'm making passwords, you see, it's a pattern of animals and flowers and different flowers and all of that. Just go to Canva and just go to book cover. So that's how it's done. You don't need to use this. Just go to book cover. Unless you have a special design that you want to make a special design cover for. Okay. So I click on that. It searches and bring out for me different types of put cover and practically i don't need to choose the style because i want to make my style so i create blank so you see here create a blank cover i just click on that i talked about how to create a cover or how to work on canva generally i'm not sure if it's a cover but then if i've not done that i'll make that in the next tutorial just subscribe to this channel and like this video so that you can get everything now from this blank we already know what we want we need animals right so uh, let me say leopard because I think that's what I saw. So I just go to elements. I type leopard. You can type zebra. You see what I'm saying? So I have one here. I've started building. I've started building. So you can just look through again and see what it's like just to reconfirm. Okay, sitting on a flower and all of that. You see how easy these things are. You can make money online. It's not that difficult. So I just do this and then I can put whatever I like, skin. I can even use this to do my background fully like that and I type some people use leopard skins for it and then if you don't like it I detach it away from it I remove it it goes away then I put flowers I can get that or if you know the type of flower then you can just type that particular name or type of flower so maybe I like this I can use this and then I put it here I'm starting to build that's how you just do it here and there you pop things on maybe trees and then your book cover is ready now to upload your book cover to kindle i've treated that already on this channel and i'll show it to you how to get it so you can upload your low content books on kindle this is how something is made you see i'm still making something out it's just as simple as that go to this uh website uh here make money online and then you would see how to upload i think it's here on the, okay how to upload on kindle you can see this will solve the upload for you like this video and i'll see you in the next tutorial because i'm leaving this playlist here please watch it so that you know everything and start making the money now remember click on the link below for your book uh boat.io at jazz low content this and then use active coupon 20 to get 20 percent off if you are purchasing